Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today we're playing two five cash games with a $500 buy-in. It's raise a low jack, hijack call, three up from the cutoff. And we'll be putting in the four bet with pocket kings. Goes for the jam, we're gonna be calling. Kings versus kings, same hand, no one gets a flush draw, so we're gonna chop it up. Anticlimactic. Um, open here, go ahead and three bet the big line ace king. And we see the four bet here. Blimers, blimers, we're sticking it in with the five bet jam with ace king. Good luck to us all in. And snap folds, so we just take it down. All right, so you see a hijack open. We put in the three bet from the cutoff. Big blind cold calls. Five, four, deuce. Go ahead and bet here. So opponent, there's definitely going to be some flush draws out there. Also, our opponents can have hands like... Ace king, ace queen. They're gonna have a gut shot going along with their ace. So for that reason, I'm actually gonna still bet here, even though an overcard comes up. Hey, James, I mean, there's a lot of draws he can have. We went third on the turn, so <sighs> cold call pre is a little concerning. I mean, double flush draw here, ace high having a gutter. We're going to call here at the 10s. Oh, he had kings. He did trap us a bit, but we hit the 10 on the river. Oh, we are so lucky. This is wild down here. Um, so <laughs> limp, we raise, he calls. We turn the open-ended straight draw with the flush draw. Do we bet and then just be willing to call it off? I think that's the route we go with here. Calls ace of hearts on the river. Love to see it. Backdoor heart flush. We will be all in here. And snap calls. He flopped two pair. He's going to be disgusted when he sees our hand, but we take it down. So, uh, button open here. Go ahead and three bet the small blind king queen suited. Get a pretty quick call. 10, 6, 3. Going to set up a check raise here. I like to mix these in every now and then. So we got two overs, a backdoor flush draw. Makes for a decent candidate, in my opinion. This line looks extremely strong. He does call, though. 9 on the turn. And because we picked up a gut shot, I'm actually going to go for this here. We're repping super strong. And does come down and call, and he's got us in super bad shape, and we do not win. Small and race here. Going to do a mix of some three betting, some calling. We'll call this time. And flop top pair, king 10, four rainbow with a heart. And call a bet. Six of spades on the turn, shouldn't change much. Bets again, same thing, just gonna be calling. Three clubs on the river. Again, another card that shouldn't change a ton. And blind versus blind, I don't think there's any way we're folding, especially when some obvious draws like Queen Jack miss. And he did have Queen Jack, so we're good. Over here, playing a three bet pot. We open the hijack, cutoff call, button three bets. We call, bets out just over third. Go ahead and call on Queen 9 6. 
four on the turn. We'll check. That's pretty big. I'm going to call at least one more here. Eight on the river. Go ahead and check. So at least the backdoor spades miss, or the flop spades. The problem is we block a hand like Jack-10, so nice that he checks it down and we're good versus ace-king. Uh, raise and the hijack here, get two calls. Go ahead and put the bet out here with king-high flush draw against the blinds. Get a huge raise. Um, I mean, as long as he doesn't have the ace of diamonds, we're in okay shape. I don't think he does this and folds a ton, but I think we just, or do we just call this? Uh, I think we're just going to go with this here. Could even fold out some like sevens, eights, stuff like that. They has maybe he'll think we have some overpairs. So we're going to go for it with the king nine suited. If we do get tank called by a hand like sevens or eights, we have two overs in the flush draw. Even a hand like tens or jacks, we have an over in a flush draw. So no snap call is a good start. Going well into his time bank. And he folds. So we do pick it up. Open button here with ace queen suited, small blind calls, and uh, ace queen suited. I don't think there's many better flops you can ask for. Ace nine six, two spades with the ace queen of spades. Looking up for a little bit of value. Oh my gosh, and he raises us. Uh, I think we just call here and then let him continue on the turn. I don't know. I think that's right. Seven of diamonds on the turn. Over bet jams. I mean, we could be behind right now, but even if we are, we have to be calling with this draw. Is, oh my gosh, a seven? He turned a two pair? Oh, I could have seen the flop two pair, not the turn two pair. That's brutal. As good as we've run today, that one was gross. We had him absolutely crushed. Uh, so that's going to wrap up today's cash game session. And we played for three hours. We played a mix of two five and one two. So the two five stats are we played 835 hands and we won $1,006 and played 151 hands of one two and we won $621. Total profit on day, $1,628. Great day. Uh, maybe didn't play the greatest, but we ran extremely well until that last hand with the ace, queen, and the ace, seven. Uh, if you guys are watching the vlog on YouTube today and enjoyed the video, please be sure to like the video as well as comment and subscribe to the channel. And if you're watching the live stream on Twitch, go ahead and follow the channel. And if you ever want to my live streaming schedule, I post it every Monday morning at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time on my Twitch schedule tab.